say you say it like that If I hate you then find someone new Maybe but you know or good evening or whatever time of day that you guys watch this video um welcome back to my channel if you guys are first-time viewers welcome to my channel I am Kendall also known as fierce to fit on Instagram so as most of you guys know I have been bulking and recently I have stepped up my game you guys just saw that I weighed myself this morning and I just had my breakfast and I'm super proud of myself because I have reached such a beautiful point in my life because I am heavier than I have ever been um, before recovery since recovery just my heaviest that I've been so bulking is really paying off for me I feel super strong and I thought I would give you guys some tips on how I've been bulking because it's hard to eat as much as I've been eating I'm eating almost 3,000 calories a day that's just on my metabolism I have a super fast metabolism um, I work out I'm really active you know, so that's how much I've been eating. But I thought I'd give you guys some of the essentials that I eat throughout my day to bulk. So I've been adding a lot of fats to everything. So my number one go-to is, of course, peanut butter. So I add this to a rice cake after every meal or I even, after every me after every lunch every day, no matter how big my lunch is, it's usually like a cup of rice with like chicken and some vegetables and some fats thrown on there. Um, usually like butter. I will have a fig bar and I'll top it off with a tablespoon of peanut butter just to get extra calories. That right there is like an extra 200 calories. So I'll do that every meal. Not every meal. Every day for lunch. Also, when I snack, I tend to snack on things higher in fat because fats have more calories. 9 calories per gram whereas proteins, carbs have 4 calories per gram. So I eat things like nuts. Nuts. Also, I've been eating, oh, avocados. Get you some. Because they are super high in fat, but they're still really, really good for you. Have so many vitamins and minerals in them that are just super good for your body. I think that's why my skin be looking mad fresh, yo, to be honest with you. But yeah, I've been eating a lot of refined carbs. So, English muffins have more carbs than bread. So I've been eating um, English muffins for breakfast almost every morning, pre-workout usually. Um, I'll have an English muffin. Sometimes I eat like two a day. So carbs on carbs on carbs. And white rice. I love white rice. Jen Bready, like I, I think that's how you pronounce her name. I watch her like religiously on YouTube and she just eats white rice four days. So I have a cup of this I, at almost every like meal meal. So like lunch and dinner. So I'll eat like two to two and a half cups of white rice in one day. And that gives me like a lot of my carbs because I'm eating almost 320 carbs not mad about it so those are like my absolute bulking essentials another thing I would say is bananas because if you're gonna try and bulk you don't want to be eating like those fruits that are all like citrusy and shit you want to be eating like carby fruits like apples bananas um, of course they're still good for you which is why I'm trying to eat like more whole foods while bulking but it's just really hard but I thought I would give you guys some big news because I have big news big news so just yesterday I went to my first something which I'm going to insert clip here
Okay, so you guys just saw that. As you guys can probably guess from that, I am competing! Your girl's competing. May 27th, Allentown NPC Lehigh Valley Championship. I am more than excited. Like, I was excited, but then I went to this practice yesterday with, like, the most amazing coach I have ever met in my whole life. And, holy crap, like, the excitement is, like, beyond excited. Because I have wanted to do this for so long long. I just pushed it off because I was making sure that I had the right mindset from recovery. And I know a lot of people feel like they need to compete to be successful in the fitness industry and I do not feel that one bit. I feel like I need to do this for me. I set this as a goal a year ago, exactly a year ago. And I said I was going to compete before I turned 19 and here I am and I'm going to do it and I'm going to tell you what, I'm going to kill it. I'm so excited to prep. I know it's going to be hard but I don't know if you guys can tell, I'm like really excited. I promised my best friend Zach last year that we would compete together and we're going to do it. And I just feel so confident in my body. I've worked for it so hard. I'm gonna continue to work for it. And I can't wait to show off what I've got. So I hope you guys can support me. Um, but yeah, that's what's going on in my life. So in May, I will be doing a, I will be doing a show. So that's what's good. But yeah, my posing, a little rough for my first time, but you know what? I think it went great. I'm super excited. It's a great start. Um, yeah, so if you guys are still in your bulk and you need tips, I hope those helped you. Hope you guys support my, my competing stance there. And stay tuned for the next video, guys. Love y'all. Mucho. Bye.